I'm Sam Hoyle, your Shafter Neighborhood Reporter. For some, Monday is just another three-day holiday, but for others, it is a day of solemn remembrance and celebration of life. This Memorial Day, friends, family, and community members gathered at both the Shafter and Wasco cemeteries to honor veterans who have passed. In talking with someone honoring their loved ones on Monday, they told me of the hardship after losing someone dear to them while serving. Now, for them, it's a day of remembrance and celebration of their loved one's life. Yeah, Memorial, Memorial Day back in the days used to be a three-day weekend, but now, now it's personal. You know? I have a brother-in-law that passed in the Army. He went and served, so now it's, it's personal. You know? Now, <clears throat> it's a day to remember him, what he did for us. If you were here today, what would you say to him? That we're proud of him. The event in Shafter featured speeches from members of Shafter and surrounding communities. Shafter Police Lieutenant Joshua Stevens is a 10-year Air Force vet and spoke to the crowd about the meaning behind Veterans Day. Brother Paul Hernandez from Free Will Baptist Church echoed a similar sentiment and gave a speech about the sacrifices made by those who gave their life in service. While the pain of losing a loved one while they serve their country may fade, their memories still live on long after they're gone. Margarita Lopez Tijerina's son, Jamie Lopez, died during her service as a Marine. But before his death, his daughter Jasmine Pacheco was born. Lopez Tijerina knows in her heart that he would be happy to see what's become of his family today. Because he would have been real proud. There's a lot of things that, that I wish he would be here. To enjoy it. And he was a good son. And he would have been a good father, you know, the way he was. To learn more about the Shafter Cemetery, you can find that information in the story on our website. In Shafter, I'm Sam Hoyle, your neighborhood reporter.